for us to fathom the human being behind the mask and the slogans. But this year, one fearless actor embraced the unfathomable role of a terrorist, bringing a full, powerful revelation of the humanity that can live in one's spirit along with the most inhuman cruelty. For his devastating performance as the extremist Bashir, in the invisible hand, the judges have voted in Obi to Usman Ali. It's really such a privilege to be here. Um, I'm sort of drawing a blank. I have a few things prepared. Um, first of all, I just wanted to say thank you to my wife, Melina, who's here with me. She's absolutely the most perfect human being I could have ever asked for in my life, so I'm so happy that she's here. My best friend, Kotaro, is here as well. I know I wasn't supposed to, but I'd like to thank my agent and my managers for being here as well, taking all my nagging phone calls. Uh, finally, also, uh, I really want to thank the entire um, Invisible Hand team, particularly New York Theatre Workshop. It is by far the best experience I've had working in theatre in I don't know how long. They really need really to focus on the work that is so important. Um, to Ayad Akhtar, who continues to write these plays, you know, if somebody had told me five, six years ago that I'd have the opportunity to be in two plays with a Pakistani lead, written by a Pakistani playwright, I'd say, get the fuck out of here, that's never gonna happen. But it's happened, and he's an inspiration to all of us, so I really, I really tip my hat to him, and thank him so much for that. Um, to my uh, director, Ken Rush Small, who apparently is very popular here. He was just amazing, he led me through this very difficult role. My castmates, Jamil, uh, Dariush, and Justin, and the entire team. Um, finally, I have to give a shout out to Chicago Theater, that's kind of where I'm from. Uh, sort of helped me learn how to be a real actor. Um, and I just want to tell you a quick little story. I moved to this country uh, 15 years ago. And because of the political ramifications of being a Pakistani, my parents were never allowed to actually come see me here in this country for 15 years. Denied visas over and over again. And so I thought they would never have the opportunity to see their son on stage. Then suddenly, thanks to this city, to this off-Broadway collective, to the New York Theater Workshop, and shit just happened in the right way, they got a visa and they came and I had the, the experience of coming out for a curtain call and seeing my mother and my father and my sister in the middle of the theater, stand up and applaud and it is an experience I will never ever forget. And I just want to say, because I think as actors, we all just kind of want our parents to really be proud of the work we do. And I thought I would never get that experience, and I did, thanks to New York City uh, and to the theaters here. So thank you again. Thanks to my family. Thanks to everybody else. Peace.